Hello, it's Pipple Pixels here, and today we'll be looking at a new game that is out on Vita called Garden Witch Live. This game is about restoring an old magical garden. You are growing strange plants and ingredients for potions, and making it a cosy home for lots of different cute little critters and spirits. You are also building friendships with the town folks. It has been developed by Free Time Studio. So let's launch a new game. Oh, and we're straight into character customization. So that's a that's a skin colour. It's cool blush colour. Face. A bit darker. Eyebrows. So she can have no eyebrows or eyebrows. Eye colour. How do you actually add value? With the green eyes like mine. Eyelashes. So that's just eyeliner. No eyelashes. Very girly eyelashes. Look at those eyeliner. We've got lots of clothes to pick. A rainbow shirt. Midnight moon top. Bear overalls. That is quite cool. She has actually got quite a lot of clothes to start with. I wonder if you get more as you play the game. The one on the bottom. Balloon pants. Cute bunnies on them. Dirt pants. Pants are a bit like leggings. Pants. Baggy pants. Patchy pants. I think we'll give her those. Oh, I get to choose my socks. Socks. Obviously, she's choosing long legs, you can't actually see the socks. And shoes you've got rain boots, soft sneakers, bead sandals, loafers, high sneakers, slippers, work shoes, garden boots, more sneakers, ankle strap sandals, wow, bear slippers, cloud boots, padded boots, sandals, and pearl sandals. I think we'll just go with the snickers. Look more like sli slippers. So, what's this? Hair. Hair. Let's look at some of her styles. Quite a few to choose from. It will go with that one. Base hair colour. Oh. Value. Oh, so you can choose primary hair colour. purple hair obviously secondary hair colour oh it's that adds sort of like tints and things what's this hats mushroom hats rose hat a sprout quite useful if you like playing Final Fantasy 14 cat ears box ears a moon tiara I want to add on the different earrings which you can't see because my my um there oh the pixels and you can pick your own pronouns which is useful she her he him they them that's a very nice touch game here we go game is launching here's some strange bird lots of potions and bottles new message hey mom i'm coming home Drop deleted New message draft. Hey mum, I'm on my way home. I look very sad. Draft deleted. New message. Hey mum, I'll be visiting. Deleted. Ugh. I can't do this. We'll be arriving at Moonflower Island shortly. Ooh, Moonflower Island sounds cute. 
The ship will hold there for one hour. This is the last stop before we begin our overnight transit to Sawville. Be sure to return on time. The ship will not be waiting. I can't go home. I need to get off now. Oh, so I'm going to get off the stop before home. Oh dear, I look very glum. Oh, this place is making me smile. Oh wow, it's very pretty. Lovely. Really nice graphics. Right, so... It's just W to walk. I wonder where I'm supposed to be walking to. This. Okay, that's where I buy something. Oh, it's choosing for me. Oh, cactus lady. Oh, hello. Welcome to Succulent Sweets. something to brighten your mood we have moon cupcakes sun cupcakes and star cupcakes if you enjoy the thrill of the night the moon cupcake is your best choice if you in if you thrive in the sun's glowing rays then the sun cupcake is for you and if you feel the same about day and night then you could try the star cupcake we'll have the moon one please great choice and maybe something to drink Green tea, coffee, hot chocolate. Let's have coffee. Coming right up. Oh, you've been studying that cupcake for quite a while now. Did you change your mind? Can I get you a new one? Oh no, it's not that. I'm, um, I'm just waiting for the drink to cool down a bit. I see. You know, I don't think it's getting any colder. I could put it in the fridge for you. <laughs> So, want to talk about what's on your mind? Oh, is it that obvious? That's alright, I don't want to be a bother. It's no bother at all, I'm just having a conversation with a very interesting person. How does she know I'm interesting? Guys, there's nothing interesting about me. I don't even have a job anymore. Ah, I thought this is why I'm looking glum. Oh. What happened? Did you quit to pursue new adventures? No. The department had to make cutbacks. I was part of the unlucky 50% who were let go. Wow, that's a lot of people. Well, that depends on size of company, really, doesn't it? <laughs> I mean, if it's only two that work at the company, 50% would be one. But I'm assuming all of them can't have made huge mistakes. Oh, no, no. Everyone did a great job. I thought I was doing okay too. I got a promotion not long ago actually. But this kind of thing happens quite often. I heard it's more about the company finding ways to save money or something. Maybe if I'd worked a little harder it wouldn't have happened. Why am I such a failure? Didn't you just say that everyone did their best and that you got promoted before the layoffs? I don't think working harder would have changed anything. The way I see it, they failed you, and not the other way around. Don't blame yourself for what others do. Yeah, you're right. But I still don't have a job. I don't know what to do. I can't move back to my parents' place. One step at a time. First, you need to eat and take a deep breath. Oh, I like this lady. You can't make big decisions on an empty stomach after all. So kind. Talking to you helped a lot. Alright. I think after I finish my cupcake, I'll start looking for a place to stay. Is there an inn here? No, but you can stay here for a while. I have a big and very comfy couch upstairs. But you've already helped me so much. I can't impose on you again. It's no big deal. You need a place to stay, and I have a place. I'm in the bakery most of the time anyway. Thank you. I'm sure there's a way I can help you out too. There we are, I've slept on the couch. Morning.
morning. I hope you slept well. Yes, you weren't exaggerating. Your couch is really comfy. What are you up to? Can I help? I'm preparing today's special. The Mooncake of New Beginnings. Baking it together will be fun. Sounds awesome. The thing is, I've never baked a cake before. Don't worry. With me as a guide, nothing can go wrong. If you say so. Okay, first we need the ingredients. We'll find the eggs, butter and milk in the fridge. Flour, sugar, baking powder and cocoa powder are in the storeroom. Can you get them for me, please? Sure. A lot of dialogue in this game. Oh, there's the fridge. I love the cute big fridge. Put all, take all, quick store, restock, take all. Oh, that's where she said it was. In the store. Need to open. Take them all. Great. Now go to my little kitchen helper and mix everything together. So this is basically how you cook. Cake batter. All the ingredients. Make it. That looks like the perfect consistency. Time to bake it. Just put the oven it in the oven and let the magic happen. Looks like a big pizza oven. Oh, I've already got another recipe there. Oh, it needs a lot of ingredients. Dough, star sprinkles, sugar, whipped cream, edible glitter, lemon juice. That sounds... Wow, not bad. Are you sure you've never baked before? You're really good at this. Thank you. I had no idea that making your own food could be fun. In the city, we usually just buy it. To be honest, baking feels similar to alchemy. What? Do you have experience with alchemy? That was my job, actually. I see. So do you want to continue on your alchemy path? I'm not sure, to be honest. I don't know what I want. All my life, I've only done what I was told. I never really had time to think about what's beyond that path. I see. Hmm. I've got an idea. Hey, I need to check on something real quick, okay? I'll be right back. Don't eat all the cakes. Hey, I'm back and I've got a surprise for you. I hope you're up for a little walk. Ta-da! Why are we in front of a treehouse? It's a magic place and it's been empty since forever. Wait, are you saying... It's yours now. But who makes that decision? Well, you do, of course. And there's no one else here to decide. The house was empty before this town even existed. And nobody else wanted to live here. Well, it's off the grid. So there's no electricity, no Maginette, and no water supply. It's um, rather rustic. Also, for some reason, Magic Buys Delivery Drones can't reach this place. What these are? I've heard about a magical aura that keeps them away. But those are just stories. So yeah, I know it's not in the best condition, but... I'll take it. It's perfect. Alright, Purple Pixels. Yesterday my world ended. Today we start anew. Wow, so I guess this is going to be my farm. As usual, lots and lots of stuff to clear. Some seeds for you. I prepared a little welcome gift for you. A yummy lunchbox for now and a delicious comfort potato soup recipe for later. I've included all the ingredients you need and the best thing is you can plant the potatoes to get more. Have fun, May. Wolves? Hey, May came by and told me someone new was moving in. I've scraped together some old stuff as a welcome. Come by the forge if you need anything better. Got some tools. Something wrong with my well. Hmm, the rope is missing. Plant a potato. 
plant a tomato. Um, we shall plant them. Plant them here. So, oh, use your wheel to scroll. Oh, by clicking on the potatoes, I've learnt some recipes. Oh, this is strange. Okay. You can actually place them where you want. And that was something to be aware of, because I've actually got one that's all the way out over there now. So what's these other things? Oh, more potatoes. And... So to move across the menu at the bottom, you just move your mouse wheel. And then you use your mouse to, to place them. Quite difficult to get them in uh, straight lines. And it looks like they have to be a certain distance apart. So I water them every day until the potato has grown a little bit. So we need the watering can that I got earlier. Oh, so it's just... Oh, that's... Uh, you're not watering each individual one, you're watering like the area. I suppose we better water this one that I've put all the way up there on its own. Learn the recipe item. So water every day until the potatoes have grown. I've done that. Use a recipe item to learn it. Okay, just click on it. Go inside the house. So I've learned how to make potato soup now. Let's go inside the house. Oh, use a sickle to cut grass. Let's go in the house first. Oh, it's a bit run down. How do I get to... Oh. How do you move things across? Oh, maybe you can't. Oh, here's a chest. So you can put them all in. Take them out one by one. Oh, what quick store does? I don't know. Pack lunch. Take that. Maybe I need it. A simple it. Well, I don't think I'll need that yet. Oh. What have we got in here? A cauldron. I guess this is where I cook. Got some recipes. Ice cubes, potato soup, star sprinkles and sugar. Cutting board. So I know how to make diced potato and sliced potatoes at the moment. It's my chest. My bed. So I wonder if this will all get rid of the weeds. Will it get rid of the weeds inside my house? Yes. Oh, and this is the grass as well that I need. So now I can make straw and rope. My house is certainly a little bit run down. That's part of the fun, isn't it? Building your house up with new furniture. Making it look pretty. So, this grass. Yes. So each cut of grass is taking two of my stamina use the workbench to make a rope let's go and make the rope um workbench use the workbench okay. table room and Oh, house for chickens, food bowl, raised bed, wooden table, paths, rope. Make it. I made one. So 
I think I can fix the well now. I should do it now. I can use it to get water. Ah. Did go inside the house. Give me any stamina back. Let's go and check that out. stay in here does it increase I don't think it does 35 well, maybe it does but very very slowly obviously going to bed and you've got the time, so it's day one, spring, Monday, 4.45, so, let's go. So, dice of potatoes, I can't do that until they've grown. Someone named Tim left a note and said to meet them at the forge, is the on that? That's my home, that's me. Tim's tinkery, that's where we need to go, a library, general store. Oh, Magnificent Magic Manor, Port, Town, Cactus Cafe, Beach, Workshop, and a Spa. What else is these then? Oh, Inventory. Okay, so these are the different quests. This is the things that, all the cooking recipes. That's Oh, all the recipes, all the crafting. Journal. That's me. Characters. These are all, so it collects all the characters that I, I meet. Note down all the places I visit. Oh, and achievements. I haven't actually unlocked any achievements yet. So let's go and see if we can find someone named Tim. Or we'll meet them at the forge. No idea if I'm going the right way. Let's go over this cute bridge. The world's very pretty. It does load quite quickly as well. Who's this? This looks like the forge. Hey there, I'm Tim. Local engineer and all round tinkerer. I just realised instead of keep pressing E, you can actually just left quick click and the. That'll move the dialogue on. What else can I do for you? Hey. Get more tools from Tim. Yo, need anything else? I need more tools. There's lots of rocks and old logs in my garden. I don't know what to do about it. Any ideas? Oh, right. Don't worry, I have something to make your life easier. I've got axes, pickaxes and shovels. I can give you the whole lot for 200 coins. Do we have any money? Sounds great, but um, I can't afford that right now. I don't think I can. Ah, don't sweat it. Take the tools now and pay me back later. You know where to find me. Oh, cool. So I've got some free ones. Why has he got money inside there? Hey Tim, I don't think I can. Yo, need anything else? I made to pay for the tools. Nice, thank you. Oh, I can't actually pay for the tools. So, do we have a little explore? What's up here? Ooh, what's this place? Use the door. On in. Somebody's house. Always amuses me in these games that you can just go wandering in people's houses.
wonder who else lives down here. Well, we know that's the cafe where Cactus Lady lives. What's around here? What's that? Community box. We find out later what that does. No one there. That's obviously the general store. The music's very relaxing. And what this place is. Thank you for your interest in this fantastical establishment. Please allow us more time for preparations. Be sure to grace us with your visit soon. That's the manner. Well, I think what I'll do is I'll go and cut some more grass or stones or something and go to sleep. I wonder how long it's going to take for the potatoes to grow. I guess I have to water them again a few times before they grow. Visually it's a really pretty game. Back home. I wonder if we can cut this down. Oh we can. They must be like weeds. Let's find out what else we can cut. There's my potatoes. What's that? Something asleep in there. What is that? Doesn't let me interrupt. Maybe because it's bedtime. I'm going to cut these down. Oh, there's a chicken there do anything with it, sleep. So if you let that happen, you wake up with just your half your stamina. So if I eat, yeah, that. Oh, I assumed eating a packed lunch would increase my stamina. Where's the door gone? Ew! Oh no! Everywhere's flooded. Oh, these are the little cute things that were asleep yesterday. Can I jump? Can't jump over there, apparently. Can I hear a pet chick? Oh. Chicken? Is it supposed to look like this? Ask maids advice for sick plants. Oh, what's that cute little thing? Pet bunny. Oh, it ran away. Oh. Ask May advice about sick plants. Go and ask May about the sick plants then. Potatoes are obviously not growing very well. Maze Cafe. E. I wonder why I actually make gold in this game. I've not seen anything yet. Make anything. What 
can I do for you? I'd like to buy something. I tried growing some plants, but they look sick. Have you been watering them? Yes, of course. Hmm. Perhaps it's the soil. You could try to fertilise it. Good idea. Where can I get fertiliser? Hmm, good question. Maybe the new general store has some. Thanks, I'll take a look. Buy some fertiliser from the general store. Went there yesterday. There was nobody there. Maybe there was nobody there. They have not been activated yet. Oh, I can see that there's somebody there. Welcome, traveller. How can I help you? Actually, I've just moved here. I wanted to say hi to my neighbours. That is a pleasant surprise. I've also moved here not long ago too. Welcome, neighbour. Nice, so we're both not from here. Yes, indeed. I'm still organising my store, but feel free to browse through what I have in stock now. I sell general goods for daily needs. Let me know if anything catches your eye. Oh, and check back often, as I'm doing my best to keep it interesting. Had the loveliest of days, neighbour. Need some fertiliser. Certainly don't need grass seed. Go to your garden. Back to my garden. Piece of cloth. Oh, again, it looks like it unlocks more. Red. Caring is sharing. Greetings, my friend. I hope you had a wonderful day so far. Last meeting gave me a terrific idea. Since we both came to this beautiful island not too long ago and we're both trying to connect with the people living here, I had the perfect opportunity for you. Meet me at the general store when you have the time and I'll explain everything to you. Okay. So I need to go back. Um, I've not got much. I'll do that tomorrow. I don't want to wake up with just half my... Go to sleep. Well, I suppose I could have used fertiliser before I've gone to bed. I'll do that first. So it's still raining. How do I use the fertilizer? Like that, it just puts it down. So I'll go and check up on the um, general store person. At least I suppose if it's raining I don't have to um, water my plants. Is it round here? I can't actually remember where it was. It is. Oh, how come my character didn't actually... It's still night time. That's weird. Okay. I'll try going to sleep again then. See if it moves the time on. I thought if I went to sleep it would be day three. mean that you can just go to bed for a little while? Sleep. Day three. Right. Water my plants. Ah, 
and go check up on the general store person. I wonder if they open at half past six in the morning. Oh, well, there's a bar at the top that shows you how full the watering can is. That's useful. Go and check up on Aro. That is very pretty. Oh, hello. What can I get you? I got your letter. Wonderful. Since we're both relatively new to this town, I had an idea about how to connect with everyone. I made these little crochet flowers in my spare time as a gift for our neighbours. But I'm still very busy organising the store. I'm sure you're very busy as well. But that skin doesn't hurt. Would you be interested in delivering the gifts to our neighbours? This way we could brighten their day, chat a bit, and it would help spread the word about my shop. And of course you would get a voucher for your next purchase here as well. What do you think? This sounds like a great idea. I'll do it. Great, I've attached a little flyer to the crochet flower so everyone will know where to find me. And of course you'll get a crochet flower as well. Oh, thank you so much. The flowers are so pretty. You made them all by yourself. You're really talented. Thank you. But it's not always about the skill. The most important thing is what your heart feels while you're crafting. Objects are just objects, no matter how well crafted they are, but infused with pure intentions and emotions they become special. That's where you can share a bit of yourself with others. Whoa, this is why this flower makes me feel so warm and happy. I'm glad it does. Oh, that's kind of cute. I'm starting to think that this box is the thing that you put stuff in. Ah, right click. To sell. Are we try it? I seem to have got loads of this stuff. Put it in there. See what happens. Oh, I remember when I first got it, there was that Magi box as well. Maybe I should have put something in there. Who's this bright? Who's that? Let's go and chase them. Welcome. I'm afraid the Magnificent Magic Manor is still closed. The Magnificent Magic Manor? Yes, and it will be grand. But it's all in due time, for now my splendour will have to suffice. <laughs> okay. Oh, bring a flower to tin. I was just... An autopilot to go and give one to everybody. I'll go and take one to tin. Oh, who's this? Hmm. Hi, can I help you? Hello, I'm Purple Pixels. I'm new here and wanted to say hi. Oh, hi, I'm Lily. I'm a full-time beekeeper and part-time carpenter. Nice to meet you. Wow, you have so many bees. I love bees. So you like bees, huh? Aren't you scared of getting stung? A carpenter? Cool, what do you make? Really? Yes, they're not very common in the city where I come from, but I've heard so much about them. I've always wanted to see them up close. They're even cuter than I imagined. I'm glad you let them into your heart so quickly. I have a feeling they like you too. Ah, I feel blessed. Well, they're all donned up in the gear and I just stood there. Hee hee. Okay. Is there anything else up here? We better run do the quest for my stamina runs out. visit Tintin. So I'm really bad at remembering where things are on the map so I've got to remember that the beekeeper is opposite the forge. Yo! Need anything else? I'm going to pay for the tools. A delivery for you. Oh, for me? 
I didn't order anything. Also, since when do we have a delivery person? Did the delivery box break down? All at once? This is the bottom clip. No, no. I think the delivery bots are fine. Oh, all right. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you like that. Scare me? Pfft. Nah. Anyway, what do you have there? It is a gift from Aral. They moved here at the same time I did. And they opened a general store in the town. This is a gift for you. A general store. Hmm? Interesting. But everything you need can be ordered via Magibuy. Or is that Amazon? Maybe, but I'm sure they'll be happy to get to know you as a person. I mean, sure, why not? And this flower is super cute. It would look great on my drawing board. Thanks for the delivery. Um, here, yeah, this is for your trouble. Thank you. Have a great day. Bring a flower to me. Take one to me. I like all the different models of the different creatures. It's great, all these little different creatures all living in the same town. Go in the cafe. Bring Cactus Lady a flower. What can I do for you? I have a gift for you. No, I don't. I was talking gift people things. What can I do for you? I've got something for you. This is from our room. They opened a store nearby. I want to I want you to have this as a welcoming gift. What a lovely gesture and so pretty. I'll visit them and thank them in person. Thanks for bringing me this. Since you're already here, I have a cupcake. I just made a whole batch. Whoa, cupcakes. Bring a flower to Lyra. Who's Lyra? We've met anybody called Lyra. I guess this is where we're going a bit of an explore. Let's go look, look on the map. We've not been. Port. Manor. Beach. Workshop. General store. Jim's Tinkery. Library. Bar. Home. Okay, there's quite a few places not visited yet. Paths appeared. Oh wow, that is so cool. Oh, going somewhere. Visit the library. Okay, library in the sky. Ah, hello. Um, how can I be of assistance? I don't think I've seen you around before. I'm Lyra, the librarian. Who are you? I just moved here. Kind of by accident. Sounds like you live an exciting life. How about you? I, um, live in my books. So you could say I live many lives. That sounds awesome. And your library looks impressive. Oh, um, thank you. Yeah, it's... It's... Is everything alright? This is a disaster. What happened? It's the tree of knowledge. It's been on the decline for a while now. But it seems to be getting worse lately. What exactly the tree of knowledge? It sounds really special. It is. They're quite rare, actually. I got the sapling from the academy where I studied as a young birdling. They're magical and ants trees that can stir a huge amount of knowledge. More than could ever fit in a library. And my tree of knowledge seems to be in a bad shape. Do you think it could have something to do with the polluted river in the town? The river in the town is polluted? Um, yes, it's been polluted since I first arrived on this islet, which is quite a while ago. You don't go outside often, do you? I uh, prefer the coziness of my own nest. It really is cozy, I like it. Thank you, I've put a lot of effort into it. Anyway, I need to do something about this. If the tree of knowledge keeps declining at this pace... No, 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 I don't even want to think about it. But the outside... Ah, I'm sure the Tree of Knowledge will be okay soon. Are you scared to leave your house? Well, uh, no, I mean... I can totally leave my house. No problem at all. Any minute now. The 
can't do it, can you? No, I can't. That's okay, don't worry. I'll try to find the source of the pollution and clear it. You would do that? Sure, I'm in for a little adventure. You're so brave, admirable. Hey, I wouldn't do it if it made me feel uncomfortable. It's okay. I'll be back as soon as possible. Meanwhile, you can look after the tree of knowledge. Yes, I'll do my best. My poor little tree. Sorry for letting things get so bad. Purple Pixels is on their way to your rescue. Until then, I'll give you some magic resin droplets. Ooh, but I never gave her the... The flower. Oh, hello. I've got a delivery for you. Did I interrupt your reading? Ah, uh, never mind. I was just... Hmm. Anyway. How, um, how can I help you? I can come back later. No, no, it's okay. I don't mind at all. Okay, I'll make it quick. This is from Aral. Who's that? Could it be a secret admirer like in that book? And please tell them I'm not interested in that kind of... No, no, no. They're actually your neighbour. They opened a general store nearby. This is a gift and an invitation to visit. Suspiciously accurate. What? What? Nothing. Um, thank you for the delivery. I will think about it. Okay. Find the source of the salute of the pollution. Oh no! Fell off the end of the world. Okay, you just come back alive. So go and find the source of the salute the pollution. Feels like I ought to be going up there. I wonder how I'll get up there though. Well, that just takes me back over there. Bring the flower to Jemmy. I wonder who Jemmy is. Maybe we should go exploring a bit more. Have a look on the map. The beach. It's far. No. Go up there then. What's this? Enter the mine. There's something in there. It looks like a honeycomb, but made out of crystals. Tin will be excited to see this. I think there's a similar structure at the gate. I want to ask him about the strange substance. Yo! Need anything else? I found this crystalline honeycomb in the mine. You're really good at finding new stuff. Let me see. This looks like a crystal battery. These are so rare. I've always dreamt of getting my hands on one of these. The possibilities. Well, this is yours. And it seems to be empty. Maybe you could recharge it at that thing in the mountains if it's still there. What thing? Ah, some kind of thunder and lightning maker. That sounds dangerous. Nah, it leads the lightning directly into the battery. It's quite safe. It's more like a snack machine for the battery. But it does look a bit dangerous. If it still works, that is. It's been there a while. Oh, it's been a while since I was up there. Alright, I guess it's time for hiking. Have fun, let me know how it goes. So now I've got diced potatoes and cutting board, which I still can't do because my potatoes haven't grown. Painting, just don't know how to do because I've got no money. Bring a flower to Jemmy who I've not met. Find the source of the pollution and reach the mountain top. But it's getting near night time, so... What I'll do is I will go back to bed. I did water my plants today, didn't I? So I will go. What I am going to do before I go to bed is I'm going to cut down some more of these and put them in that magic box. Thing that we clicked on right at the beginning. See if that's how we make money. Don't want to wear my I did water them. Into the house. Go 
go to sleep. Hmm. So far, it's a really, really easy game to play. Controls are easy, easy to remember. I'd like it if you could zoom in on the map. That would be quite useful. Water the plants. that I wonder if more bits of cloth everywhere oh ouch what was that okay I wonder if I can cut it down Ah, nettles. There's bits of cloth everywhere. Where do all these come from? going to be making something with all this cloth. Oh. Ouch! Right. I think we'll go for a little exploring. Oh, I don't actually think I watered that one. I've missed it. I should buy some more fertilizer. We'll wait, we'll, we'll wait a day. That was the mine, so what's up here? What's this? Oh, that's the house that went in earlier. What's up here? Oh. I think the source of pollution is up there somewhere. How do I get up there? it lets you you don't have to stay on the path you can move around quite freely what was up here This is the spa that I saw on the map earlier. Here for a vibe check. I am new here. New base in time. Wonderful. I'm Luam. I won the spa. It's a place where you can relax and reconnect with yourself and the universe. She's close at the moment. Thanks, maybe I will. Oh. 
visitor. What are you doing here? Um, I mean, do you have an appointment? I didn't know I need an appointment. Can I make one? You can't get an appointment just like that. I'm very busy. Okay, so how exactly do I make one then? There's clearly no need for you to make an appointment. You look healthy. Try to exercise or eat healthier or something. Now, if you'd excuse me, I have an important research to attend to. Okay. Didn't seem very friendly, did she? Why is there two doors in here? Just lead to the same place? Yeah, it's just a different door. through that gap. Uh-oh. I think I might have just bugged the game. Nope, I'm out. If you like all the pets, eventually they become oh. pets of the game. What I'd like to do is to see more of the cooking. What I might do is put some more of this. Oh, I've not had a go at smashing anything yet. Rocks. Break any rocks up? Yeah. Uh, maybe I'm using the wrong tool. See? That's for wood. I can clear rocks with this. my stamina into the house go to sleep none of my potatoes have grown I would quite like to see those Quite open that they'd be grown today. What I might do is just oh, things empty. Need to refill. I think what I'll do is I am going to wear my stamina out by. Put in some more of these down. I wonder if breaking things up, where's that tool gone? You can do things like so you can break fences and some of the things up that so like these maybe. But this is really the tool for removing things. I wonder if I can remove some of the rubble from inside my house then. Use. Oh, so you can um, remake your character here with all all the options. That's cool, like a wardrobe. Yeah. That's quite good. You can 
clear up some of the mess inside your house. I don't know what this is and why it don't break. I've still got quite a lot of stamina left. Let's not. How much stamina does it take off then? So I'm on 27. Okay, so it takes off quite a lot of stamina to cut wood. I wonder if it's just broken wood or can you cut trees down? Stamina's nearly gone. I'm guessing the lack of stamina will change as you get more cooking. I really do want to be able to see the potatoes cooking. I want to see what the cooking's like. Not the grown yet. Not yet. I'll do the same again. Bought them. And it seems to take quite a long time for the things to grow. So I'm going to. Dig. Oh. Okay, go and do some more stones. How much stamina does it take off for stones? I wonder. It was six for the ward. We're on 31. Same. up there maybe I should have gone for a wander up there I've not got enough stamina now so if I go, go to sleep and we'll go and have a look up there Like things have grown. Can I not pick them? Seems not. them up. Ah. Okay. Right, let's go and have a look what's over there. And then hopefully... Actually, it looks blocked. Leave clovers. Okay. Didn't really go anywhere. Let's play the farm up a little bit and go to sleep again to see if we can get the potatoes to be picked. Right, 
exactly what I might do. Is cut down some more of these. And then we go to town and we put them in that magic box. I'm guessing if these do sell in that magic box, they're quite a good source of income. With the four leaf clover. Ah, it's blocked from the other side, so that's. Oh, I wonder if I can chop the thing down at the other side that's keeping the door shut. I might put something in the magic box. Are these grown yet? I don't understand how to how to harvest them. Maybe. Go and put some things in here. All right, put all, and then let's just take out the things that I actually want, which you just do by dragging and dropping. I don't think I actually. I'm gonna take those because I want to. Right. I have nothing in my hand. Does that let me harvest them? I'm starting to think that something's gone wrong with them. Let's go and try the magic box. Ninety-nine coins so far. If we put something in the magic box. Let's see if that increases at all. I think it was down here. To see if it actually increases or not. It's just like the end of the world. What's over there? to get up there. I think what I'll do is I'll go to sleep and if I can't harvest the crops this time then I think I've bugged them out because they're obviously grown I would have liked to have seen the cooking they're not saying 
anything like pickle or anything. Maybe I'll try watering them again. I wonder as well how I dug this owl. Um get some of the seeds. I wonder if you can dig a hole and actually put the plants in the hole rather than just have them in a piggledy piggledy mess. I would quite like them in neat rows. Let's test that out. Seeds. Go and see if we can place a seed in it. So I'm going to go to sleep. Ah. ah, we can finally pick them. Which means we should be able to look at... Oh, we get quite a lot of potatoes. They're not ready, so... Let's go and have a go at... 26 potatoes from the 8 seeds that are put down so we should be able to it wanted nice potatoes make it oh you actually have to chop them that's quite good so keep chopping keep chopping chopping Chopping. Oh, I see. The more you chop, once you've actually chopped them small enough. So this is quite cool. I do like that idea. So now can I cook? Use a cauldron to cook potato soup. Potato soup. I need parsley leaves and salt. So let's go to the general store and see if we can buy it. I hope we don't have to grow parsley next. I would really like to have a go at doing something. I've not watered these today. Go to the general store. Parsley and salt we need. We have to hope they don't cost more than 99 gold. Oh, I'm guessing they're not not open on Sundays or it's too early. I wonder if my thing's still in the magic box. We're we'll gonna have a look at that. Or if it I've still only got 99 gold, so or 99 coins. Quite sure what the currency is called here. Let me pop in and see this lady, see if she's got anything for me. What can I do for you? I'd like to buy something. Bread, bun, cake. Oh, I wonder if these increase my stamina. Let's try. So I thought that was the way of selling the stuff. Maybe it's not. So the general store is not actually open. Can we go in his house? No. Okay. Is my stuff still in the community box? Ah, 
Ah, we visit it and it gives you the earnings. That's quite cool. That's how you make money. So I could put more in there and then I could do that painting off. So I've got more of those. So I guess the idea was you were supposed to cut lots, lots of that down to repay the guy. I guess go to bed until the shops open. Oh, mm. Monday. Refill that and pick that now. Oh, so the those keep producing. No, that's quite good. Let's go. is there now I want to try the cooking out ah here he is oh hello what can I get I'd like to buy something and I want tomato potato parsley leaves and salt sugar eggs flour milk water salt thank you right let's go and cook Use a cauldron to cook potato soup. Use a cauldron. A potato soup. Make it. Add diced potato. Okay. Add salt. Okay. Boil. Oh, I see. Keep clicking heat. Until it gets oil stir and that add parsley and stir oh the heat's going down and stir and stir don't it so we've had a look at how to grow things we've had a look at how to make friends with people we've had a look navigating around the map we've had a look at the chopping and the cooking i think that's quite enough for for one day we've looked at look at making friends looked at clearing the farm i think all in all it's a really pretty game navigation is is um the, the maps useful is it tells you where things are but i think the navigation of it is not so easy um the growing the crops is easy the cooking's quite good fun. I think all in all, it looks like it's going to be a, a really good fun game. Okay, if you like this, like this video, please like and subscribe. Leave comments, etc. Thanks a lot. Bye.